Looks like a Chinese Jiangwei class cruiser with a North Korean destroyer escort. Events in the Yellow Sea took a turn for the worse today when North Korean and Chinese forces blockaded and boarded a Japanese cargo ship. The North Korean government released no official statement, and their ambassador remained out of contact. While at the UN, Chinese Ambassador Long Dan urged the US and her longtime Japanese allies to remain calm, calling the blockades a legitimate response to what the rest of Asia views as a possible remilitarization of Japan. This blockade is an act of war. The NSC is working on a formal response, and they've ordered the USS Walsh to close at flank speed. The Walsh is the most advanced spy ship in history. My best man will be on board. What do you know? Chinese and North Korean ships working together again. It's what we expected. That's a 056 prototype, Chinese. Exactly. How are your sea legs? I haven't lost them. Good. Because the 056 prototype isn't the only new fish in the pond. Admiral Toshiro Otomo, head of Japan's newly formed Information Self-Defense Force, had this to say. This is another distressing attempt by China and North Korea to further depress our faltering economy. The ISDF and Japan appeal to our allies for the military support promised us under the post-war constitution of 1946. The fact remains that in the eyes of many in Asia, the ISDF itself is a violation of the post-war constitution prohibiting Japan from maintaining a military force capable of striking beyond its borders. In Asia, the memories of Imperial Japan are still fresh. separatist group called the People's Voice. Their suspected leader, Hugo Lacerda, is a hardcore revolutionary preaching information. This place international holds the contract with Wright Pritchard.
I'm hearing gunfire down there, Fisher. Everything all right? It's coming from up ahead, but Lambert. And I think Gorilla. I think Kalashnikov. What do you mean? I've had enough AKs fired at me in my time to tell you that wasn't one. All right. See if there's anything unusual going on with their equipment. And keep a... Bus post. I think you're right about the equipment, Sam. Yeah? They got themselves a little stockpile of high-tech kit here. Try and find out where they got it. See if those crates have SSCC barcodes on them and scan them with your EEV. Don't you think he's had enough? He's had enough when he can't talk. Talking? Madre de Dios, he hasn't been able to speak for an hour. He could be faking it. Don't you think he's had enough? He's had enough when he can't talk. Talking? Madre de Dios, he hasn't been able to speak for an hour. He could be... Sam, what are you doing? Making see. sure he's not suffering. We're leaving needle rounds in his... He could be faking it. Jesus. You see, I bet he's faking it. Faking it? His tongue is a lump of coal. His brain is... Enough! Saul, give him more. It's already at the maximum. What? Should I bring down another battery? <laughs> what do you say, amigo? You want another battery? <laughs> Wait a minute. His... Uh... His ears! Look! Smoke! I think I'm going to be ill. I think he's dead. <laughs> Only one way to be sure. Uh, I'm going for a walk. Doesn't sound too good down there, Fisher. The sound isn't the problem. I should smell it. You're sure he's dead? Deader than Elvis. All right. Leave the body. We still need to recover any traces of the interrogation. Grim, we'll call you back.
Sam, it's Grim. We need to make sure that whatever Morgan Holt might have told them about Mass's algorithms never leaves this site. Okay. I detected a wireless link coming from the technician who left the room before you entered. So I'll need to recover any data he might have uploaded to their servers. Exactly. From the looks of it, these gorillas have a pretty temporary setup. Seems unlikely they have any kind of alarm system on location. From the looks of it, these gorillas have a pretty temporary setup. Seems unlikely they have any kind of alarm system on location. Good. Something there? Do you hear that? You mean that scraping sound? No, it was more than it. Probably not. Ah, there he is! Did they both get away okay? See. Si. SCC code is lot one of five. See if you can find the other four. I'll do my best. That server is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. Good work, Get Sam. That wiped here. whatever information more. That server is the one that the tech transferred the interrogation record to. You'll need to access it. Good work, Sam. That wiped whatever information Morgan Holt might have given them. Don't they wonder what happened to it? It was easy enough to make your little intrusion look like a memory allocation error. Don't worry, we give you the best tools. Evening star to Maria Narcisa, come in. Evening star to Maria Narcisa, come in. Maria Narcisa here. Who is it? Evening star. Cargo is... Maria Narcisa, 
You're not trying to set me up on another blind date, I hope. The Maria Narcissa is a boat. So was the last girl you set me up with. Fisher. Sorry. The Maria Narcissa is a cargo ship owned and operated by Celestinia Inc., Portuguese shipping company. Registered in the Philippines, cross-Pacific freight contracts. Lots of details missing. Sounds suspicious. Sounds like I'm setting you up for, for another date after all. Can't wait to meet her. Fisher, your primary objectives are complete. I'll extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup at the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Can't wait to meet her. Fisher, your primary objectives are complete. I'll extract you whenever you're ready. You'll need to signal for a helicopter pickup at the top of the lighthouse. Make sure the light is out first. Will do. Sam, from everything we're seeing here, it looks like Lacerda's already flown the coop. Sam, from everything we're seeing here, it looks like Lacerda's already flown the coop. Scratch the objective. You don't need to worry about taking him out. The body of kidnapped American computer engineer Bruce Morgenholt was discovered in a village in Peru this morning. Implicated in the kidnapping and failed ransom attempt is Hugo Lacerda, alleged leader of the People's Voice, a newly formed guerrilla organization. Here we see the USS Clarence E. Walsh en route to the Yellow Sea for her first assignment amid rising tensions in the region. Dubbed the flagship of a 21st century fleet by Defense Secretary Mason, who reaffirmed America's commitment to our Japanese allies. It is our hope that the presence of the Walsh, now the world's premier electronic and information warfare platform, will help defuse the tensions in the region. Information you recovered in Peru makes it look like Hugo Lacerda was contracted by a third party. 